Hi folks, Mike from TradeStalker.com. This is a recap from October the 19th, Thursday, October the 19th. This was the, the Wednesday close right here. And we had a gap down open by quite a bit. Open down here in the, uh, in the 50 and a half, 50 half 50 area, which was, um, uh, a minor area for support. It came down here and it immediately popped up. And I put a note in the chat room in the chat box that uh, that this area shouldn't be taken out and held, and um, it should be a pullback from this area, which happened. This was the um, this was the uh, 54, 55 zone. So as you can see, they popped up here, made a quick reversal, and um, pretty steady down right through. No hesitation going through the 50 area, 50 F area. Came right down to this, um, our last listed support. This is a major pullback support zone down here at the, um, at the 46, 45 zone. Made a low at uh, 40, let's see, if, I'm sorry, the, the zone is 55, 54. We made a low at 55 and change, 55 and a quarter. So right in the zone, right in the zone, and then uh, this was a target, a profit target down here. Uh, they immediately turned up, which pretty much was telling us that, and it turned up at uh, 10.20 a.m. So, again, the, nine, the 9.50 to 9.20 a.m. time frame, we have a, a reversal. Um, they only popped above here and came down through, but just a brief amount of time through this 50 area wasn't acting as um as much of a, a resistance but the pullback was just one and a half points and then back up we went so um uh on this i think we were in our starting our trading trading session um and we had a move a move from this 50 and a half area up to again up to the uh, 50 54 55 prior Initial support, a turn resistance. They stalled out here for quite a while, right in its own. Three little pokes into it. And um, then we had just a small pullback. It didn't really lead to much. And that was, uh, with that being the case, uh, in the Dow, if you look at the Dow, it was uh, steadily trend up all day. So we got this move into the zone again. And another tiny, just a tiny pullback. They were worth the, if you're scalping this area, and that was all you're planning on doing, then you're okay. If you're looking for a big move back to the lows for some reason, then, um, which we weren't, we were looking at this as a possible trend up move. In any case, um, even with some shorting opportunities along the way. But, uh, they found that they broke out above this zone and then held. We broke it and then held here. On a dip, that would told. I said then we should be going up t to the next zone at uh, at uh, 58, 58 half, which we did. We came right up here and stopped, uh, poked over it by one tick. Again, just another small pullback from the zone. So these are just kind of acting as areas for the market to pause this after uh, today and this afternoon, and then uh, back up. Once they took out, took out the highs here, and they had a short coming run at the end of the day that missed this uh, initial resistance by just uh, half a point. So, had a pretty good day. We had a bounce back to um, early drop and bounce to uh, what was new resistance. Uh, steady drop down to a major support area. Then basically a trend up move with a pause here, pausing at resistance at the 54-55 zone. And um, using these as targets on the way up uh, made out for some pretty good trading opportunities. So that was it for our day today. Um, hopefully you guys will join us. And um, looks like volatility should be back. So um, hopefully this is a, a sign of things to come. So come join us, tradestalker.com. We'll be happy to have you on board. Uh, we get you signed up right away and ready to go tomorrow. 
So have a great evening and good trading tomorrow.